so I just got to Vancouver and we're really excited to be at the Clean Energy Ministerial. I think what we see this year, which is different from any previous year, is a real sense of urgency. There's been a shift since the last IPCC report was published, really raising the alarm for how fast we really have to act to solve climate change. One of the really interesting things about the Clean Energy Ministerial is this is the first year that nuclear energy has been represented. Canadians want and expect governments to deal with climate change. Solar and wind are important, but right now solar and wind can't get us to Paris. We need something that is a step change. And small modular reactors could be that big step change that we need to get us to Paris. We're at a time now where the labs need to say, how do we take all of the know-how, all of the expertise, and look to the future and do the next great thing? At Canadian Nuclear Labs, we have an aspirational goal of siting a small modular reactor by 2026. Now, we've got vendors from all over the world coming to Canada with an interest in siting in Canada and specifically an interest in siting their demonstration reactor at one of the CNL managed sites. Well, everybody's figured out by now that there is a market in Canada and uh, everybody's trying to get to that market. The number of vendors here seems like it's strong showing all together. We need all of these technologies and indeed all of the technologies uh, meet a different industrial need. What's really interesting is the export potential because that global market is huge. That's one of the big exciting things about small modular reactors from a Canadian perspective. And then if you take it outside Canada, it's Canada's contribution, if you will, to helping the world develop clean energy economies. We don't have the luxury of time here. We really need to move fast to take out most of the carbon from our whole energy system by about mid-century. But the good news is, is that we're seeing some really important progress here in Canada in delivering the tools that will help us to make this transition as fast as we need to. But we have to get behind it and we have to act fast.